Welcome back to Your Tech Software from Your Designs Mobile Solutions. Now we're going to go into inspections. Inspections is probably one of the more powerful pieces of this particular product. And the reason being is that the inspections that you do will eventually turn into more money for your uh, company. Um, most likely, if you've ever been to a place, uh, let's say for instance Jiffy Lube, and went in and took your car in, one of the things that they do is they, they will change your oil for $27.95 or whatever the typical price is at that particular point in time. But when they do that, one of the things that they do is they pull up this list and start giving you all kinds of information that you probably need to do and kind of talk you into a couple things, either, either you know, changing the transmission fluid or changing the differential fluid or changing out uh, air filters or something along that line, which are basically considered upsells. The inspections kind of work in that way, but the advantage of this is something that you're going to like on the next page, because if you note something that is necessary, you don't have to actually start that conversation with the customer. The customer will automatically see that something needs to be done and that will request that they take some action on that particular piece. So let's get started by just basically selecting the type of PM that we would like to do. Um, some companies we will have this set up where it automatically selects the type. Other companies prefer to be able to select the type, so we want to let them select the type at this point in time. So I'm going to select PM Forklift. And as you can see, it ran through these particular inspections and pulled a bunch of information in really, really fast. So um, what we did is we have several different pieces that we want to kind of walk through here. As you notice, we have some in gray, we have some in white. That's just an alternating color so you can keep your eyes aligned properly. The other one here is a yellowish uh, kind of goldenrod color. Kind of keeps it, uh, lets you know that there's something slightly different about that one. And when I get to it, I'll show you what that is. So the first question is normally have the checks been done, and you would normally have that communication with the customer, and they would say yes. Um, does the unit run correctly? You may have made an adjustment or something, so you would click on there that you're adjusted it. Um, any unusual noises? And you could say, no, nah, there's nothing on there, so we're taking care of that. And then here we get to the section where we say horn. Now what happens is, if you notice, there's a pop-up that popped up down here. So what we can do is we can say that you know the horn's not operational, and we can click on this little button right here, it says need horn button kit or inoperable. So now it says in there, and you didn't even have to type this, which is really, really cool, that there's a horn inoperable, so therefore they can't, that is a safety item, and we're going to talk about that in a few minutes, but you guys know that that needs to be working. So we'll do one more here, which is the lights, and what we're going to do with this one is we're going to say that, uh, that it needs to be repaired so we click here, and then we have a place for automatic response, but there's nothing in this particular one. So we'll leave that one the way it is, and then move on to the next screen. So now, in most cases, you're going to see anywhere from one to quite a few. This one here actually has around 54 different inspections because of the type of equipment that it is and the class that it falls into. So there'll be different places where they have different things. This is kind of enough to get in to get the point across. So what we're going to do from here on, oh, there was one more piece. I wanted to say, for instance, I didn't have a response here that kind of outlined that. So what I was going to do here is go here and say, hey, the lights are dim. So now... Now, well, if I can type properly, this would work even faster. So I'm going to tell them that the lights are dim. And as you can see, I've got this information in here. So what I'm going to do, oh, no. I click up here, and it automatically shows up, which is really great. So that gives us an indication that we know how to do this. So once you go through all of your inspections, you would basically complete it and then go on to the next screen. So I'm going to end this one here, and then we'll pick up on the finalized stage in just a moment. Okay, thank you.